I thought we'd get started in LT Spice by me actually doing it live rather than uh, going through a PowerPoint. Um, I used to do tutorials in a static fashion, but I'd like to try to see how it works in video format. So I've started LT Spice, and I'm just going to start a new schematic by clicking the new schematic icon. And this comes up. And the, what I want to do is save it. In the example, I used voltage divider, but I have voltage divider already there. So I'm going to call it voltage underscore divide divider dot ASC. That, that way it won't overwrite anything I've done. Now I need to add voltage supplies and resistances. The best way to do that is click on the component and then voltage. Okay, and I just stamp it down. And I can click on the resistor and resize the window. That'll give me R1. And I'm just right clicking here. Then I need a ground, which I'll place here. And now I'll wire it up. I just press escape to get out of st stamping things down. And you see this crosshair. I click on the node, draw up a little bit, right click, uh, excuse me, left click, left click again for the corner. And then it ends when I hit another node. I do the same thing for that node. Left click, draw it over, left click, finish up on that voltage, come from the ground, and it puts a solder dot. And I'm not sure if I've mentioned it yet, but my colors are different from the standard colors that you'll see due to the fact that I'm trying to make it a little more easy to read for others. I need to put on some net names. That's the net label net cursor. And I can just put a 1 here. And that will come up as V voltage at node 1. All right. And I want to put in V reference. And I'll just call it reference. Okay. And if I want more than one node name, the same node name in more than one spot, I can keep clicking. All right. If I need a different name, I have to press escape and press label the net again. Now here, all I have to do is right click and the DC value prompt comes up, 3.3 volts. Press OK. This was one meg. Um, that's case insensitive, but I like to to follow the convention of capitalizing that. Click on R2 and that was 432k. Right. And if I wanted to change the name of the resistor I could just click on the actual resistor name and edit it to maybe something more meaningful. All right. So this is almost ready to simulate. So we click on the simulation tab and click on control panel make sure everything's okay we actually want to edit the simulation command we see all these choices today we want DC operating point and see it's right there stamp it down if I fail to do that it won't run correctly um, now I'll press run and up pops the voltages that we had calculated that you should have seen properly. Now I can show you some things that will happen if you make a mistake. For instance, if I delete what we're actually simulating, the edit simulation command will, will come up. And I'll have to choose again this simulation. All right. Um, if I have forgotten to put in a resistance value 
and I run, it says, hey, missing resistance value. Sometimes uh, they're not, the, the errors aren't so helpful. I press run. All right. Now, of course, you'd want to save the circuit so that you can come back to it later. Um, another nice thing that you can do is comment your designs. Uh, I can I can just add text and I can type in V reference should equal 3.3 volts times 432 kilo ohms divided by 1 meg plus 432 kilo ohms. Um, that's kind of like programming syntax. It doesn't, um, because it's coming up in blue, it's actually a comment and it doesn't, um, it doesn't affect the simulation. But you can put in your name or the students can put in their name. So a lot of times when I'm checking to see if somebody's done their own work, a lot of times it'll come out in the comments because if everybody did the circuit, this particular circuit, the the way I did it, um, it'd be pretty hard to tell if it was mine or somebody else's. Now you can go through and design, change this to 5 volts and design resistors to get it that reference voltage to 2.5 volts.